वेलकम स्टूडेंट इन माई न्यू सीरीज ऑफ ट्यूटोरियल बेस्ड अपॉन अडोब फोटोशॉप फेमस फोटो एडिटिंग सॉफ्टवेयर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई स्टार्ट द फोटोशॉप आई सर्च एयर फोटोशॉप यू कुड सी ऑन द टॉप आइकन इज एयर आई क्लिक ऑन दिस आइकन ऑल दो आइकन कैन बी प्रेजेंट समवेयर ऑन द डेस्कटॉप ऑल्सो यू कैन क्लिक फ्रॉम देयर so this kind of icon and interface will appear in front of you it is taking some time to load and you will see the previous pics on which i was working so directly because first time i am starting the photoshop so i'll click here create new i click on create new and just wait this kind of dialog box will appear new document first of all it is showing me the recent layouts on which i was working so first of all i'll introduce you some of the formats and uh, along with the recent it shows saved but i have not made any so afterwards the first option by default which is given by the photoshop photo you will click upon photo and it is showing me different sizes like default photoshop size 7 by 5 this is ppi pixels per inch and uh, this is landscape 2 by 3 this is in inches okay so simply with this format you could think that uh, it is the different sizes these are the different size which is by default given by photoshop so according to our need we can select our size so just now a simple introduction i am giving you along with it print option is there if i click on print you could see different size is here also letter 8.5 multiply by 11 in then a4 now this is the size you could say the most popular size uh, the paper which we are using for photo state that size you could just uh, imagine of now suppose here it is written millimeters i can click upon inches i can click on pixels So I can click on inches. So eight by eight point two six eight width and eleven point six nine three height. And uh, resolution is three hundred pixels. Now this is appropriate if you are using any printing work. But just now, as we have to start learning Photoshop, so I'll recommend you you could use only seventy five. And actually, this resolution is okay for. web pages or for learning purpose because more resolution you will use although the clarity of the image will be more but the loophole is that it needs more resources of your computer and if your computer is old or your laptop is old you may find a problem so we will use uh, 75 resolution and then background content this it, it will ask like white black background color and if i'll just scroll my mouse button or from here i could see two more options transparent and custom now these options are available for uh, all the layouts or all the sizes given by photoshop like art and illustration web you could see on web also it's showing only 72 then film and video if you are making an image for a video then 1920 by 1080 by default resolution but i used to say blu ray and here resolution is 72 so first of all i'll use photo only i'll work upon photo and from photo default photoshop size 7 by 5 so i'll click upon this only but instead of resolution where it is given 300 i'll use 75 or 72 depends okay 75 i am using and then instead of white i am using here transparent that means my background canvas will be transparent i'll click on create now you have to wait for some time and you will see this default interface now the area what you are able to see here this is called workspace this is called workspace and on the left side you could see tools panel 
this is tools panel you could see here there are different different tools available here and slowly and slowly i'll teach you how to use the tools then on the top whenever i'm clicking upon any tool the option comes on the top suppose i'm selecting this you could see these options so this is called as options bar so whichever tool i'll select according to that the options of that tool will appear on the top here in option bar and then on the top this is a menu bar like file edit image different different options are coming here and then this is the title bar on the top and the different panels like these are the different panels in other language i could see toolbars but actually we used to see it as panels and then these are the layers these are the layers like here it is shown layer 1 so this was my the first tutorial the basic tutorial in which i have taught you how to start adobe photoshop so i'll be making a series of tutorials and all the tutorials will be a short one not too lengthy so that it becomes easier for you to understand so i'm closing my tutorial and if you like my tutorial do like comment subscribe and share okay bye bye take care and wait for my next tutorial